What is going on, you guys? It is that time again to shoot week 31 again. Uh, <laughs> yeah, I accidentally uploaded um, the same week of TTMs twice, and uh, man, I was getting all kind of mess messages and <laughs> comments. And uh, um, so, luckily, we have a stack of 10 here um, that was going to be for next week, but. Uh, we can go ahead and, and jump ahead and hope like heck that I can get in some more before next week's video. Um, just sitting here watching little Collector's Dream Orlando walking around um, sharing his thoughts. I kind of enjoy videos like that, those long form videos um, where fellow collectors are just kind of sharing their thoughts on the hobby and stuff. You don't have to agree. Um, but it's just nice hearing a different point of view. So let's get into it. Obviously, we're going to keep the camera how it is and jump right into it. We will just get to ripping. What we got here? Jerry Logan. That is his rookie guard. Signing two of two. I sent off a grip. Um, from that shoe box I bought from Baseball Collector seven, eight months ago. So I imagine you're going to see a ton of these come back. Yep, and that's more of the same. I mean, I went ham, dude. I think I sent off like 40, like a week. No, it was like, uh, it was two days before the National. Uh, that's when I sent them off. So signing two of two in ballpoint pen, Tom McLeod. It's kind of tough to see those. Oh, nice. Um, this one was sent off to Harold Carmichael. I've got him a couple times lately. Um, but he finished off this quad auto which if you haven't done like a multi signature piece i'd highly su suggest this one it's super easy um it's really fun i think all of them signed for free except for harold jackson which he's like 10 bucks so you can get all of these signed for ten dollars um it's pretty good and i was thinking the other day that you know, we're more than halfway through the year. And when I started this series, um, which, by the way, I, I kind of plan on just doing it for 2024. Um, it's a lot of pressure, man, uh, to keep it going. And not pressure from you guys. I put pressure on myself. Um, I'm a very goal-driven person. And so um, whenever I see the TTM slowing down, I just go ballistic and just send, 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 send. Um, and so I just can't keep that up, man. It's still fun. Don't get me wrong. I'm not, I'm not burnt out. Um, but we're in August now and, and I've been able to do it so far every single week, which I think is insane. If we can go 52 weeks and get 10, 10 TTMs a week, um, that's pretty cool. That'll probably, well, uh, not probably, that's the longest project that I ever did TTM related. Mr. Bob Johnson, that's old, that's old Bob's rookie card right there. I can always tell it's his rookie card because of like how happy he is. He's like smiling like, this is my rookie card, you know. And that, you see how he's like frowny on that one. That's not his rookie card, but definitely he's happy that this one's his rookie card. Yeah. <laughs> nice been getting him in quite a bit lately um he's twenty dollars per and yeah i'm just trying to get the run man i actually bought a couple more on ebay last night super gorgeous and the card itself is in amazing shape <laughs> oh, dude. 
There's no way. Is this freaking real? Charlize Theron, um, actress. Ding! If you know what I mean. Um, dude, there's just no way. I think that it's kind of out and about that she uses an auto pin machine, which it's, for those that don't know, it's basically, it's a machine that the actor or celebrity or athlete signs their autograph once and it memorizes that pattern. Basically, it programs that pattern in and then whatever you set underneath it, it, it signs it. Um, so it's kind of tough because it looks just like their signature because it's modeled off their signature. Um, but kind of some giveaways is like pressure points with a pen. You know, when you pick a pen up and, and you sign and you drop the pen back down. This one doesn't have any whatsoever. So we will go with a half success on that one. Man, dude, I was super excited. I don't know, man. Mm. I think I know it's it's not real, but I just want it to be real so bad. It's like mind tricking myself here. Ugh. We'll go ahead and say it's it's not real. Ah. Ooh, baby. Oh, there's one facing me and facing you. Roy Emerson. Did that freaking tennis set is awesome dude if you um are a big fan of just ttming um and you don't really care if you know mega mega names which in, in the sport of tennis these are mega names in that set but man these players in this set sign really really well and just about all of their addresses are on star tiger and so he signed two of two Wrote Best Wishes and then Hall of Fame, what is that, 1982? That's the year I was born, dude. Holy smokes. His career was over when I shot out of the old Batcave. We got here three more. Ooh, ooh. Oh, this is a nice one, man. Rebecca Lobo. I think, I could be wrong, I think this is a rookie card. Um, and she is in the Basketball Hall of Fame. That's really cool. Dang. I really like that success. That's, that's awesome. Man, it's in blue. Man, that's gorgeous. Oh, yeah. Bang. I believe my boy, my TTM brother from another mother, Michael Myers, got him in this week or maybe last week. If you don't know Michael Myers, he's the guy that goes, Mill Day, Mill Day, Mill Day. <laughs> Every time I know he's about to say that, I turn the volume down. I wait a couple of seconds and turn it back up. Um, I love his enthusiasm for TTM and man, it's awesome. And this is super cool. Um, Leroy Kelly, NFL Hall of Famer. Rookie card. Ooh, man, that's that's sweet, but not quite as sweet as this massive crease that's in the corner. Now that is cool. <sighs> Brutal. Last one. Here we go. Do, do, do. Oh, oh, crap. It's facing me. Oh, baby. Boy. Ding Ling. I bet y'all want to see it. Not, not my Ding Ling. The card. Whoa. Look at that, dude. Um, this was already signed by Roy Face. And I sent this off to, um, Vern Law, and typically that wouldn't be like a, a roll of the dice because he's been signing 
everything for decades. But I hadn't seen a, a TTM success from him, and there wasn't one on Star Tiger for like seven, eight months, something like that ish. And so I thought maybe he stopped signing, but this is freaking cool, dude. Man, any of you Pirates fans out there, this is this has got to give you a freaking hobby boner, dude. God dang, man, and they're both in blue. That's a freaking amazing way to end the week. Dude, that's a great way to freaking reshoot week 31, if I don't say so myself. So, until next time, adios, be safe, bye-bye. Toodles.